guys, welcome on my channel for Wheels by David. Today I would like to show you how to fix the problem with Turbo on Peugeot, Citroën, Ford, uh, some Volvos, yeah? If you guys are interested, let's have a look. So, if the faults are like this, Possibly you need to replace this valve. This is solenoid valve, valve for turbo and I will show you how to do it. Let's have a look. So this is solenoid valve for turbo and this is located in here on 1.4 engine diesel on 1.6 diesel will be located somewhere in here and on 2 liter diesel will be located behind the engine in the back yeah so the 2 liter engine is the most difficult what is to do for this valve yeah uh, now we have to remove these two nuts one in here and the other in here this needs be take it off the clip yeah so we need to put wiring on the side remove these two nuts and these three hoses so the first nut you can use a magnet to catch the nut would be easier yeah second nut I don't think you have to remove the walnut, just uh, leave the nut on and you can slide the valve off here. Yeah? Now I have to remove the plug. On the plug you can see that is yellow plastic in here, this is locker. We have to push down and then is a lever in here, press it and pull it plug out. Yeah? So to remove the plug we can press this yellow thing down and leave the plastic in here. Plug is already broken, I don't know why. Okay, came off. Yeah, it looks like that. Yeah, you need to press this yellow down and yellow down, and then lift this, uh, this plastic in here. This, yeah, sometimes in here is a lever, but. This one I don't know that is broken or is not in here. Okay, now I have to remove the connectors and remove the valve. Okay. This one holds in here, just we need to pull yeah, it's off the other one. Remember guys which one is which, uh, the green one is to the green one, but uh, the color can be different sometimes. So. If you are guys not sure, better take a tipex or marker and mark it, yeah? Now, we have to remove this clamp in here. You can use a snips for it or something other. 
Oh, this pops off easy. And last uh, is short pipe in here. So remove this pipe or whatever take with this pipe off, yeah? And then you need to remove this valve and replace it. So I took it off. In here was the short hose, yeah? Uh, every model could have a different connection like uh, 1.6 and 2 liter and 1.4 could be a little bit different, slightly different. So better mark this each pipe, each hose, yeah, each connector. So make sure that you put it in the right position, yeah? So this we can throw away. Uh, how to check this valve usually how I do it you can blow in each connector and if losing a pressure usually is faultly yeah this one losing but the new one not yeah you can compare to the new one so we need to swap this one connector in here put it back back in the right position and connect to these pipes, put a plug on, clear a fault and that's it, should be done, yeah? Okay guys, so this is done, yeah? Plug back on, two hoses, yeah? One and the other one on the other side with clip and third one like the filter or something, yeah? Like I said, sometimes could be different connection on different type engine, yeah? Remember about nuts in here and here, and that's it. Thank you very much guys for watching. If you are happy with my video, please leave me a like, subscribe my channel, and watch me again. Thank you very much, bye.